it's, it's been really interesting. The last year, uh, just about a year ago, I took a sabbatical from my business and I'm um, just making a coffee here in the studio. Um, I, I took a sabbatical from my business. I wanted to um, rest and recharge after after COVID and the way I poured myself into supporting my students through through the last three years or so. And isn't my ceiling so pretty? This is a conversation with me. It's always about multiple things and then I interrupt myself. Um, but I was thinking about how, how thankful I am for the gift that art has been for me. Because in the last year, I've, it's been a, it was a sabbatical, but what it really was, was a year of growth and a year of healing. And if you have to heal, <laughs> um, if healing is necessary, it's because there's hurt there. There's some brokenness. And I, I've been, I've spent my whole life, I need more water here. Um, I've spent my whole life wanting to be, wanting to be good and wanting to heal from everything in, basically immediately. Um, not really letting myself um, live, feel my hurts. Um, I just wanted to fix everything. And so this last year I've had to unpack um, things that were hard, things that hurt me, um, and live with them so that I could really let them go for real instead of just, you know, willpowering them out of the way. And, um, and art has been a gift from God for me because through making paintings and wanting to grow as an artist, I have had tools that I have been able to use now to to learn how to then process some of the, the coping strategies that I'd put in place so I didn't have to face my own hurt and powerlessness and vulnerability um, and my fear. And um, I'm really, really thankful for that. There's a future for me because um, I have these tools for growth and healing. And um, it's really, throughout this whole healing process, I've never had a doubt that I would be able to heal, that I would, there would be a, a beyond and after, <laughs> that not, that feeling, feeling my pain didn't mean that I was going to be stuck there forever. Um, I think there was a niggling anxiety that that might happen, but I knew that because I know how to grow as an artist, uh, I could do this in my personal life as well. Art has been that gift for me. God knew I would need that because he knows I'm a, truthfully, I'm a fearful person. And um, so he knew that I would need something to give me the courage and faith and trust that I could, um, I could be vulnerable and brave. <laughs> and uh, so I'm really thankful for that. Art has been this amazing gift in that way. Um, so I don't have to armor up and stay safe in my little um, cocoon of never feeling, feeling my hurts. And I, I don't know, that's just been really special for me to realize today. It's kind of a non-art related topic, but um, it's mattered a lot to me. And it's something I'm really thankful for. Uh, I think it's why I talk so much about artist mindset. Um, and as I get to teach about it, I'm still learning for myself. It's really humbling, but that's okay too. <laughs>